Is that one strutting down there? I think so. Maybe. I don't know. still on the far left. Yeah. You, if they come in, you take your pick. They're both good birds, but I think the one on the left is the better one. Okay. He's showing his strut.
Congratulations, Mr. Kelly. Thank you, Abe. <laughs> that come through. <laughs> you did good. Good That's shot. Very exciting. Very exciting. How are your nerves now? I'm okay. I'm okay. As soon as he went down, I was okay. <laughs> Man, they were close. Fun, that's that's, fun, fun. that's where you you get your nerves whenever you can watch them from 200 yards yeah. away coming. I mean, when they first when they you know really coming, that's when that's when it hurt. Yeah. I think that's a really good bird. Boy, I hope so. I hope I got the right. But both both of them were yeah, good birds. Yeah, there ain't nothing wrong with that other one. That one that didn't have a beard, that'd be a trophy too. Yeah. He probably got a dang inch and a half hook. <laughs> mm. I think like they'll get in that old potash, you know, and get that fungus. Yeah. And it'll burn them all. Yeah. We still got that hen out there. We could have we could have killed three birds right there. Mm -hmm. But it ain't about it ain't <clears throat> about killing everything you see. No, it would have been no problem. Uh -uh. You could have been tagged out this morning yeah. with a single shot. You could have loaded three shells and blasted them. <laughs> I've been one over because of one in Sumter County. Folks think that the ground blind don't work in the middle of an open field. Here you go. Yeah. Set it up yesterday. They ain't never seen it before. Come right in. We paid go. absolutely no attention to it they, whatsoever. They did not. <laughs> they paid attention to Jeffrey. Yeah, they like. Oh. That big fan facing that way, oh. you know, I think that was good. That all was perfect. I mean, I guess it worked the same way it came this way. Yeah. No. Well, that, that it, it's hard for, I mean, you, you don't get a bird work that perfect. It's just straight in like that. And that's what I was hoping for. I mean, it's just perfect. I never could t quite tell, understand where you told me they came from. It was in that belly. That, that, the tall, skinny oak tree down there, right oh, in the middle, tall, right skinny. in that, oh, okay, right okay, in that V. Yeah. That's where they roost at, and they they come straight out and they follow that yeah. windrow pile right there. That's that's why you couldn't see them because of that pile. And I guess that's where that gobble came from. I could have swore it came yeah, from right there. Yeah, I think there. That they've roosted but, in the yeah. woods and got down and, and come this way. <sighs> that was nice. Did gobble, gobble one time this morning. That was it. One time. So sometimes you don't hear a gobble, you know turkeys are there. Just stay there and yeah, be patient. Yeah, you know, I don't mean they're out there. Mm. Be patient. It's a good thing about a ground blind, you got to be patient. You're not like you're going to pick it up and move it in the middle of the morning. But you can sure be comfortable in it. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, you know, old Cabela's chair and armrest and. Yeah, plenty of room. You weren't plenty bumping into nothing. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Might need a longer barrel for that shotgun so it stick out the blind. <laughs> you about to shot that. <laughs> Do it. Yo, you was close to that. Was I? Oh, yeah. I guess I was, because there he was. I was about... Yeah, you... I wonder I didn't get some of that, but I don't think... You, I you, bet you made it. I was... I was closed close. my eyes whenever you shot for shrapnel. Uh, that thing had... Mm. That thing had some... Some pressure behind it. It hit me yeah. in the face. <laughs> Did the blowback? Oh that yeah. Event. Oh, you want to go check that bird out? I love to see him. All right. You want to try it again? <laughs> I'm a motor right here. Yeah. They were about the same. It's got a pretty long beard on him. Yeah. That longest strand might be tender, man. You got any hooks? Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh, Let me yeah. get a shot of them. Hey, Sharp. Ooh, 
that's a good bird. What do you think, Mr. Kelly? Well, I think it's been a wonderful hunt. It's very exciting, very nerve-wracking. See them gobblers coming in that far away, and oh, man. Don't mess up. They were close. <laughs> they were close to each other. Jeffrey was close. I mean, this has really, really made my season. <laughs> Just a super bird. It is. I'm happy for you. That's awesome. <laughs> thank you, Mr. Joe, too. Yeah, thank Privileged you. Privilege of coming down to the river property and getting one of your turf. Yeah, we're down here in Macon County, Georgia. The old Flint River bottom turkeys. And we did good. Did we good. didn't kill no more. Mm -mm. <laughs> <laughs> I think he's pretty. Yeah. Well, congratulations. Thank you again, Mr. Abel. Yeah, we'll. We'll try to do it, do it another time this year. See what happens. folks name's Kelly Wallace one-eyed Jack lost my left eye in a barroom fight over a red-headed woman years ago just a joke but I did lose it but we're down on the Flint River in Macon County I'm 65 been hunting since I was 10 uh, Florida mostly a lot of wild quail wonderful time plenty of fish few deer, not many turkeys. Got into turkey hunting, moved to Georgia, bought some property in 92. I think I killed my first bird in about 96. Been loving it, addicted to it ever since. Abel took me on a great hunt this morning. Big cut over down here, Mr. Prendergast property. We both work for him, Indian Mound, LLC. Um, just picture, picture perfect. Three nice gobblers came in just like they're supposed to. Don't hardly ever do, but just like they're supposed to. Close together. Got about 15 yard shot. Like to ruin Abel's ears, but we got him and he's a real fine bird. He's got uh, nice sharp spurs. Good, probably 11 inch beard pushing it. You know, probably 20 pound bird, but this is what it's all about to me. I mean, just being out in these woods and just put up with mosquitoes a little bit once in a while, but other than that, uh, nothing to complain about this lifestyle. Feel very fortunate, I'm very happy. I had a good guy and Abel did a wonderful, wonderful, wonderful hunt. And we'll probably try to do it again. <laughs>